fraud detection it plays a very big um, role, right? That's a good example because daily people are either depositing or withdrawing money, uh, be it online or through banking apps. Machine learning then helps us to identify fraud and any behavior changes that the activity of the individual is undergoing. So you'll get alerts, people get alerts because of AI. Now robots, I'm not talking about the red, yellow, green ones. We, we were very creative when we played with our robots in the beginning, um, but they are about defining the processes that we do in operations that are routine steps where you typically capture an application form, okay? Um, the robotic process automation software that is used is coded with those steps. So when an application comes in from a client to email, uh, the robot will take this form, it captures the needed information on the system and the process is automated and that allows the humans to do meaningful work if we think about what's happening in the next you know in the next in the future the next five to ten years around the ai industry right um like i said transformation has really happened 10 to 15 years ago already <laughs> it's been happening right it just depends on if you get the forefront of it i think things mm. like blockchain is almost like history now already okay building out these financial ledgers cryptocurrency that have happened but the things that are coming through now are virtual assistants Okay, so virtual assistants, I think we haven't yet or not many um, of the public understand what a virtual assistant can do for you. People understand things like the um, Apple Siri and Amazon Alexa, right? You know, takes an instruction mm. and goes and surfs the net and does things for you. But virtual assistance is coming through in our banking space now um, to be more creative.